So we, we like to do one meet before the athletes go home for the holiday break. So this year we did our first meet at Franklin and Marshall on December 7th. And really the point of that meet is the people that aren't doing cross country started practice in this, as early as mid-October. So it's just fun for them to really get a meet in because they've been working so hard for a couple months and they're really anxious to, to compete. And then for us as coaches, just to kind of see how the training's going and how they're progressing and just get a kind of an idea of where they are at that point. Yeah, so on the men's side, as far as leaders, I mean, we re really look to kind of Richie Case and, and Clement and um, really look at those upperclassmen as, as the leaders right now. But we definitely have a really talented group. I mean, Richie and Derek were both at Nationals last year indoors, and then we're hoping to add a couple more, maybe with like Patrick Watson and, and Idris Idris this year on the mid-distance and distance side. And then we just have a lot of great newcomers. I mean, on the, the sprint side, we have Cameron Summers and Damon Green that are going to fill in those um, the voids on the kind of that short sprint side that we lost last year. And then we also actually have a hurdler now in Damani Jones that just came in as a freshman as well. On the women's side, we're looking to get a couple individuals to nationals as well. And um, we're looking at maybe Rachel Panic making it in the pentathlon. And then um, Emily Gates had a really good cross country season and a really good opener at that FNM and meet. So hoping to get her there. And then we have a newcomer in um, Kelly Garriott in the high jump. She transferred from Elizabethtown. And then Danica Ani in the throws. She's already thrown a mark that, I mean, she broke the conference record in the first meet in the weight throw. So it's, it's exciting. So I think the biggest thing as far as goals for the athletes is they all want to improve on what they've done before. And if, if a lot of them do that, then I think we're going to be really successful. I think on the men's side, we could have a pretty large group, our biggest group yet at, at the indoor national championships. And that's a goal for them on that side. And then, yeah, the same thing, just trying to get, get more women to that national championship meet.